How's it everybody? Gabe here from the Hawaii Institute of Self-Reliance. His survival. Welcome back. Mahalo for watching. I recently got tagged by Mike at the Lanky Woodsman. Thank you Mike. I will provide links to all the related videos and all the related channels that I talk about in this video in the description box. So check them out. Check out the description box. And I will provide links to all the knives that I talk about in this video. Basically, it's my newest knife, my most budget-friendly knife, and my most used knife. That's what this video is going to be about. And I will start with my most newest knife, or the newest knife that I got. <laughs> now, I have two that I received at the same time, the Bark River Bushcrafter and the Bark River Tracker. So I'm just going to go with the tracker and show you upgrades that I've done. So I've got it in a a baldric set up right here and I added the dangler to give it a little bit more stability right so it's not tilting as much and then I added a ranger band for extra security because in the jungle right you lose your knife it is worthless so let's see if I can get this out so basically just like that and it's not coming out right unless I want it to. Now I'm not gonna be a samurai and, you know, cutting down zombies like with the sheath in one cut. That would be kinda, you know, hard to get out. But I just want my knife to stay in the sheath. I don't wanna lose it, right? And I talk about this a lot on my channel. A good sheath is just as important as a good knife. If you lose your knife, it doesn't matter how good it is, it's the jungle and it will be gone. <laughs> the jungle eats stuff. The tracker! The tracker eats the jungle though. Ah! Yes, the Bark River Tracker. Look at this. My newest knife, had it about a month. It's all lubed up, ready to go on a hike. I really enjoy using this knife. Oh yeah, comfortable handle, beast of a knife. Oh, awesome, awesome knife. And I'll provide links to videos I've done on this knife, my review, and quite a few other videos I've done with this knife. <laughs> so that's awesome, I'm digging that. And the new sheath setup is really cool. It takes a little bit to deploy and you know put back, but you know what, security is a lot better and in the jungle you can lose stuff very quickly now to my most used knife this is a bark river grasso bolo 2 as you can tell i have used this knife a lot a lot a lot the beast of a knife 5160 steel nine inch blade Bolo design, they don't make it anymore, but this is a beast of a knife. I dig it. And there's a rumor that Bark River will be making a new Bolo design. Hmm, that's kind of interesting. So this is Convex Edge 5160, like I said, it is definitely a beast. I have used this knife for two years and it's done everything. Everything imaginable a knife could do. Now to my most budget friendly knife. I think more is going to dominate a lot of YouTubers category in it. <coughs> when it comes to the, you know, best budget friendly knife that you own. Well, Mora is definitely going to dominate, I believe. And there's a reason why. These are awesome knives. This is a Mora Companion. I like the orange color, and it's a stainless steel version. And I have done tons of stuff with this. It's a great work knife, great bushcraft knife, great fishing knife. Uh, just all around, Mora, quality, great knives. I mean, come on, $11, can't beat it. Stainless steel comes with an okay sheath 
but I just throw it in the tackle box or throw it in a bag, you know, it's not really my belt knife, but anyway, $11, you can't beat it. <laughs> now to the YouTubers I'm going to tag. First, Dave at the Humble Trekker, and I think he's already done his video, so he's on it. And he's in England, awesome guy, awesome, really cool. Now, Alaskan Bushcraft, uh, Matt at the Alaskan Bushcraft. Uh, I've watched a couple of his videos. Cool, I'll tag him. And I will tag Leo from the Irish Zombie Nation. Booyah. Okay, Leo. Uh, you know, no no hurry on, on making these videos. I know Dave, he's on England time, so he was like ahead of the game. You know what I mean? So no, no worries. Make your videos uh, whenever. It's not a big deal. And no pressure. <laughs> and I will provide links to all those channels in the description box. Everybody go check them out. We got some cool stuff going on over there. At uh, oh, I mean, really, you got England, Alaska, and I believe Leo's like in Oklahoma or Ohio or you know somewhere you know in the Midwest. I believe. I really gotta find out where Leo is. He's in no. He's in Kansas. We're not in Kansas anymore. That's right. <laughs> Cool, so we got Kansas, Alaska, England, and Hawaii. Amazing, the world is amazing, right? Awesome place. So, again, check out those channels. I will provide links to all these knives that I just talked about that I've done videos on. And, um, I've done a plethora of videos on the tracker, for sure. And I'm about to do a long-term review of the Mora Companion and the Park River Bolo. I should do a long-term review of that, too. Uh, I've had that thing for two years. I used the snot out of it. Anywho, I'm going to wrap this video up right here. And I thank you for the like. Thank you for the subscription. Make sure you hit the bell symbol to get notifications from when I upload a video. And you can watch it and tell me what you think. Until next time. Hello! Ha! Yeah!